She's going to be on set. One of the very few artists who have ever hosted and performed on just, just Saturday Night Live. Mm-hmm. Just a handful of those. Really? Very few. I'll tell you what, she's, she's getting into everything. She's doing everything. She will be the host and musical guest on the same night on Saturday, November 7th, hosting Saturday Night Live. I just um, really can't see that. Oh, I think she'll do fine. She's had some acting stuff. She's uh, I know, very outgoing, and I think she'll do d- fine on the I musical side. I just can't side. see that her mom are letting her hang around that bunch of dirty mouth people. You better bet mama will be right there. You think? Mm-hmm. Yeah, mama won't be far. You don't think? Uh-uh. All right. Then. She won't be hanging out with those Oh, you folks. don't think? No. She'll just show up for practice and, and yeah. get her out of there. Uh-huh. I got you. All right. So, uh, 748, 12. That's on November 7th. In case you want to put it on your calendar and change your plans uh, to make sure you catch that. Or you can just TiVo it. And some folks will change their plans. Oh, I'm sure they will. Yeah. 748's 12 till. Got a question. I, I went yesterday. I've been having for about a week now, I have had a sinus headache mm-hmm. uh, that I just kind of get rid of. I mean, it has just been a, a pressure-packed, thumping kind of uh, one of those things behind that eye on that side. Just been, ah. And um, so I, I went I ran out of... Out of uh, Sinus medicine. So, so I went to the drugstore, and usually my wife keeps this stuff supplied. I haven't purchased any in, in some time. And I went in and uh, asked the lady that I couldn't find it. I said, "Where's the uh, Where's the Sudafed?" She was, "Oh, you have to go back to the pharmacy for that." I said, "Well, I don't have a prescription. I just I just want you know Sudafed." Just she over goes, the no, counter type. You got to go back to the pharmacy for that. Uh, they have it back there now. I said, oh, "Okay, no problem." And you'd you'd have thought I was buying a gun. They, for Sudafed? For Sudafed. Uh, apparently, they... Is there a waiting period for Sudafed? Uh, well, no, but they took my license and ran it through the computer and checked uh-huh. to see if what? I had a criminal record. And apparently, that's what they use to make uh, meth with. Sudafed in uh, meth? Apparently. I think there's everything in meth. Well, that's what I thought. I thought it was just like everything under the kitchen sink. You just put in a bowl and... Mix and, it up. And dried it up and then, you know, chewed on it or something. <laughs> I don't know what to do with it. Yeah, do what, what do you do with I don't that? know. I don't well, know. Well, after seeing the effects of meth, I mean, yeah. I've seen people that have been on it. I mean, who would want to take that? They stuff? look like Skeletor when they're done. That's have you terrible. seen that in there? Yeah, I don't know why anybody would think that was a good idea to do that the first time. I mean, look at the pictures of the people who have done it a few times. Right. And not not only that, but, I mean, this stuff can explode, and you know, mm. like a bomb. Yeah. Yeah, if... If the people that go to clean this up have to go in in exactly. hazmat suits, in hazmat suits, it can't be good for your insides. Absolutely not. Well, she only gave me. I, I, she said, "How much do you want?" I said, "Well, you know, give me a couple of boxes. That way, I don't have to come back." She goes, hey, "Well, here's a box." They can only give you one. She gave me and 20, you have to get twenty-four a, tablets. I didn't know that. And apparently, my name is now registered with the state that I bought Sudafed. And if I go back and try to buy it again anytime soon, it will raise red flags. Mm-hmm. So I hope my head clears up. Well, how how long has that been? I mean, huh? how long has it been that way? I mean, because I, I, I want to say I remember buying Sudafed off you, the you, ca- over the counter at well, Walmart. No, they, they have a, a kind that doesn't have the uh, pseudo whatever, whatever the medicine is that, that makes meth. Yeah, yeah. They have a brand that they took that out of. So basically, it's like eating a, 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 a you know, piece of candy. Wow. It apparently doesn't do anything. But you can buy the fake Sudafed. And- well, I was looking at this story yesterday from these people that got arrested West Ashley uh, for having a meth lab. They mm-hmm. pulled them over, and inside the car, they had 72 red Sudafed pills, 30 other antihistamine pills, 7,000 matches, a can of Camper's cooking fuel, bottle of rubbing alcohol. Well, you should stop. You're just telling somebody what to use for meth well, the, here. No, the paper said it, and then when they got to the house... They found peroxide and rubbing alcohol and drain cleaner and coffee filters. Well, see, filters I, bought, I and... bought alcohol yesterday, too, so I'm sure they, they are watching me now. I bought, I bought Sudafed at the counter, and I bought a bottle of uh, 91% alcohol. <laughs> well, you're on your way, it looks like. I'm on Did, my way to making meth. Do you have any drain cleaner? Well, I'm sure we do at the house. Coffee somewhere. filters, airline tubing, I, I don't know about iodine it. crystals, uh, no, matches. I, I ain't got none of that. Got a digital scale? I got No, I ain't got none of that. Well, I... With all of that stuff combined, I just don't know why you would, would want to put it inside you. And then you would eat you. that, or, or sh- sh- what do you do, shoot it up your nose? Do you snort it? I don't know. I don't know how. I don't know what happens. Smoking meth, it seems like I've heard that phrase before. 
Well, I've seen pictures of people who do whatever they do with it, and it makes that's like makes their skin yeah. I don't want any part fall of off. It don't, may you know bust that. up and stuff. It's bad. I don't want that. Okay. <laughs> it's not good news. I don't think it's good news. Weasel, good morning. <laughs> hey, yeah, it's been a couple of years now that they've had it behind the counter. Yeah. Because I've noticed um, when I go to purchase at the drugstore and stuff, it's bad. And I asked them about it, and they they said it's because people shoplift it so much to make meth and everything. Oh. And as far as I know, I've got a friend that's on the um, police force over here, East Cooper. Yeah. And she tells me about people that have meth mouth. That's what they look for. So apparently it's smoked or something like that. And you can tell because the people's mouths, either the gums or something, get dark or, or black or something like that. But meth said that's one thing that they'll look for is to see if someone has meth mouth. Mm. Um, well, I don't have that. <laughs> I don't either, thank goodness. I don't have yeah, that. That's why it's back there. Um, but I'm, but I'm, on, I'm on record now. They scanned my license. I'm on the record with the state drug enforcement people now that I buy meth and alcohol at the same time. He's got a big old head and a bad ear. Does that flag anything? <laughs> I don't know, but, but I guess they consider it a controlled substance now. And, um, Isn't that amazing? They, they just, you can't just go buy you know, three or four different kinds or whatever like you used to and um, if that's the reason, the ing wow. some ingredient in it is it's what they meth. use in meth. That's great. Hey, thanks for filling me in. I appreciate it. Well, if you're doing uh, nothing wrong with it, yeah. it shouldn't be an issue. Then. Boy, it's not. I'll just have to go back and get some more next time. Yeah. I'll, I'll just wait a little while. I'll yeah. do it tomorrow. No, I'm not going tomorrow, and I'll probably go to a different drugstore and won't buy alcohol. <laughs> you don't think that'll be suspicious, do you? Oh, hey, look, I'm just stopped up. That's all. That's I it. need to get this snot out of my head. <laughs> I, all I want is a little red pill to clean my head out. That's all I want. You know? Full time saver traffic from the Gerald's Tire in Michigan.